Hello from Zagreb, my name is Paul Bradbury from Total Croatia News and here is an overview of the news from Croatia this week, powered by Pixel. EPP leaders in split praised Croatia. The European People's Party, EEEP, gathered this week in split for study days at its last meeting before the European elections in June next year. The leading politicians of the European People's Party in Split discussed current topics and preparations for next year's European Parliament elections. In addition to the host, Croatian Prime Minister Andrei Plenković, the heads of the European Commission and the European Parliament, Ursula von der Leyen and Roberta Metsola, and other guests were present at the meeting. The key topic that will dominate the coming months ahead of the European Parliament elections will be the fight against inflation and raising the quality of life of EU citizens. Slovenia strengthens police control of the border with Croatia. Slovenia has decided to introduce police checkpoints on its territory in the immediate vicinity of border crossings, including at the border with Croatia. The Schengen regime remains in force and it will still be possible to cross the former border crossings without any control, but there will be police checkpoints on the territory of Slovenia where the police will stop and check individual vehicles. New map of electoral units. On Thursday, Parliament passed the new law on constituencies. It is a law that does not bring changes to the existing electoral system, but partially changes the boundaries of electoral units. The rearrangement of constituencies brings the biggest change to Zagreb, which, instead of four, is now divided into three constituencies. Zagreb now falls under the first, second and sixth electoral units. Former Croatian national handball player Denis Buntic arrested. Former Croatian national handball player Denis Buntic was detained by the police in Lubushki last week after his wife reported him for domestic violence and weapons were found during an inspection of his house. The court soon released him with a ban on approaching his wife within 100 metres and an obligation to report to the police every day. Buntic said goodbye to his national team career in 2018. In the Croatian jersey he won two world silvers, European silver and bronze and Olympic bronze in 2012. The eighth edition of the International Bicycle Race Crow Race. It is a race that brings together the world's best cycling teams and their passage through Croatia is followed by the eyes of sports fans all over the world. This year's Crow Race ran from September 26th to October 1st and the race hosted 20 cycling teams from Europe, Asia, America and Australia. As part of the six stages, the cyclists on a route of almost 1,000 kilometres that traditionally connects the coast with the continent pass through eight counties and the city of Zagreb, covering both already known and completely new destinations. Olympian Damir Martin rode from Vukovar to Ilok in honour of Vukovar veterans. Croatian Olympian and rowing representative Damir Martin presented the Vukovar Rowing Marathon for eights and rode from Vukovar to Ilok, 34 kilometres in length single-handedly. This undertaking by Martin is also a thank you to all previous rowers, organisers and sponsors who have participated in this event so far, as well as support to all future competitors and friends of the marathon. The Vukovar Rowing Marathon was started 19 years ago with the aim of promoting rowing and honouring the 204th Vukovar Brigade and the 32 dead and missing members of the Vukovar Rowing Club, as well as all Vukovar veterans. Over 1,000 rowers, over 300 crews from 42 clubs, and nine countries have taken part in the marathons held so far. Indian summer in Croatia. After the recent bad weather, the whole week from Tuesday has been nice and warm. A real summer. Temperatures reached 29 degrees. Many at the sea took advantage of the beautiful weather for sunbathing and swimming because the sea is still warm, between 23 and 25 degrees. There is no shortage of guests either, and most of them are from Germany, Croatia, Slovenia, Austria and Czechia.